Magic happens. meal for it. You are definitely getting your money's worth. This food place was so good that I felt like in Kikaka. And remember, yummy in your tummy. Our best restaurants in town, you know, is very famous for their meat. And a lot of people, local and tourists, they, they come to this restaurant. So it's, it's very popular. Instead of souvenirs, and there it's local. It's made out of seeds, shells. If anybody makes a trip to Belize, you know they always meet me out here, so they could buy a Belizean souvenir. If you're in San Ignacio and you want a good place to have a good meal and lots of options for even the kids, or you want something local, or you want something fancy, definitely recommend this place. Well, here in um, San Ignacio, well, the traditional is like barbecue. Most of the people. You know, look for a barbecue whenever they come to San Ignacio. So, like, whenever you want good barbecue, you go to Santa Elena. They have um, Boyton's barbecue. They also have um, Rodriguez barbecue. There's Tasty Barbecue Finger Licking Barbecue. And now 
also rice and beans is also a tradition food here in San Ignacio. And for that, they have um, Hannah's restaurant. He sells very good um, rice and beans. Our mom's backyard whenever you come to San Ignacio. And a lot of people like San Ignacio when they come. Because we have beautiful places to go visit like the San Antonio, the ruins, Caracol. They have Pine Ridge when it's summertime. A lot of people come here to go to Pine Ridge. It's very good. They have their very nice pools there to swim. They also have Barton Creek where people like to go swimming. You know the river, the local river like Bullet Tree and so on. And we are a mixed culture here. We have like mestizos, we have Garifuna people here, we have Hindu people here, Muslim people here, Chinese and Maya people. All different ethnic groups we have here in San Ignacio. 